Hello everybody. It's so wonderful to be here with you today. My name is Jessica Rally, and I am one of the authors of the book, Yes, No, A First Conversation About Consent, which I made together with my friends, Megan Madison and Isabel Roja. And I'm gonna read it for you today. I'm so excited. Yes, No, A First Conversation About Consent. This is my body. It belongs to me. I am learning all the names of my body parts. Belly button, vulva, butt, elbows, penis, nipples. What body parts do you know? I am the boss of my body. I like doing things that feel good. What are some things that you like to do with your body? It doesn't always feel like I'm the boss of my body. My grown-ups make some choices for me because it's their job to keep me safe and healthy. What are some choices that grown-ups make for you and your body? Sometimes I don't like the choices that grown-ups make for me and I feel upset. It feels better when grown-ups ask first or let me know what's happening and why. We're all putting our, on our helmets to keep us safe. Everyone is different. Some people love hugs. Some people would rather blow a kiss. Some people love to get dressed. Others would rather be naked. People like and want different things at different times. Do you ever like hugs? When? The only way to know what someone wants or likes to do is to ask. Asking if something is okay with someone is called asking for their consent. Tickle monster? No. When we ask someone for consent, they might say yes or no. Can I pick you up? Yes. If someone says yes, it means you have their consent. Would you practice saying yes with me? Yes. But if they don't say yes, the answer is no. Would you practice saying no with me? No. When someone says or shows no, it's our job to listen and stop right away. There are lots of ways that people say no when they don't want to do something. So we need to pay extra attention. Stop. Not really. Maybe later. I don't know. Not today. I don't like that. Maybe. I'm not sure. There are lots of ways that people show no too. A no can be a sound. It can even be silent. How are these kids showing no? Sometimes a yes can change into a no. Everyone is allowed to change their mind. Tell me about a time that you changed your mind. It's okay if you hurt someone's feelings when you say no. What you want for your own body and it's okay if your feelings get hurt when someone says no to you what they want for their own body matters too you didn't ask first 
What helps you feel better when your feelings are hurt? Sometimes it's hard to say or show no. Grown-ups can help you say no or help you make a different choice. Would you rather blow a kiss, a hug, or a high five? Amina said stop, so don't throw those at her. We all have the right to make choices about our bodies. Whether the answer is no or yes, consent feels so good. Would you like to read this book again? The end. Thank you so much for listening. It was really fun to read this book to you. Bye, everybody.